Hello, my name is Karen with MSI Supply, and today I will be talking to you about gate valves. Gate valves are the most cost-effective and commonly used valve in this industry. They are not sufficient or intended for product throttling, nor are they a pickable valve. When ordering gate valves, there are several components that you will need to know and specify when you are ordering these. First and foremost, you will need to know the body and trim materials of your valve. For body materials, they can range from A105 carbon steel to A216 WCB carbon steel to forged and cast stainless. Of course, your exotics like Monel, Hastelloy, Inconel, and others are available upon request. For your trim material, meaning the internal components of the valve, like the disc, the seats, the stem, and the back seats, will need to be specified. The most common trim is trim 8, also known as 13 chrome, followed by trims 12 and 5. Other not so common trims are available and we will be more than happy to help you find these if you are needing them. Next you will need to specify your pressure rating. For forged steel valves, your pressure ratings will vary from 800 pounds to 2,500 pounds and sometimes 4,500 pounds. It's also important to note that the diameters available in these valves are half inch to two inch, typically stopping at inch and a half. For your WCB cast valves, your pressure ratings will follow that of your fittings and pipe schedules. For example, your fittings are 150 pounds, 300 to 600 pounds, 900, 1500, and so on. Your end connections available are flanged or butt weld, and those will match your pipe. For your forged steel valves, your end connections will match those of your forged steel fittings, being socket weld or threaded. If you are needing one of each socket weld or threaded on each end, it does not matter which side is which as gate valves are bi-directional. Next, you will need to know the bonnet type. The most common bonnet type is bolted. Welded is available and readily available, and then you have pressure seal, which is also available. Finally, you will know, need to know the port type that you are needing. Options are standard or reduced and full port. Gate valves are also OSNY or non-rising stem, meaning outside screw and yoke or non-rising stem so that when you are in tight spaces, you don't have to worry about the stem rising and messing up whatever you have. Here I have a two inch, 150 pound, raised face A216 WCB trim eight bolted bonnet OSNY gate valve. As you can see, the ends are flanged and the markings on the flange are 2 inch 150 pound WCB. I also have a 3 quarter inch 800 pound socket by thread A105 trim 8 bolted bonnet OSNY gate. One end is socket weld and the other is threaded. When ordering gate valves, some common mistakes people always make will be to say just give me the standard. There are obviously several different options for gate valves and there is no one standard. If you are unsure about what you are needing, there should be a tag on every valve telling you everything you need to know about that valve. If that tag is missing, there are also stampings on the actual body of the valve that will give you a better idea of what you need. MSI currently stocks Bonnie Forged A105 Trim 8 bolted bonnet OSNYs on when in all end connections. We also stock Barrick Raised Face WCB Trim 8 bolted bonnet OSNY full ports. We are capable of providing any brand and any trim with their respectable end connections and pressure ratings. And just remember, MSI Supply is available 24-7 for all of your valve and material needs.